to another MetaZoom Nightfall release event box unboxing. Now, uh, release event box comes with one of five random decks. Grandmother Spider, Broken Vampire, which I've pulled. Uh, Headless Annie, Carson Vader, which we got. And Chinu. Now, I've already cut this. Hopefully, you can get it. Yeah, nice. Yeah, so uh, honestly, I'll take a second curse in the meter. Alright, come on. Please be. Oh, the curse in the meter. Oh well. I said it could be him. Well, that's okay, because we got another one right here, which I also pre-cut. I think I gotta do a little more on the label. Or the sticker. Oh no, I got the sticker off. Oh my goodness. See, this is why you don't gamble. Oh. Alright, I just doubled up on the ones I already had. Oh well, if you want to see these, um, yeah, the links will be down there, yeah, in the description. So, uh, yeah, check them out, and I gotta, gotta do some substitution here, and I'll be right back. So this is like, just became basically Cryptid Nation release event with Nightfall Packs. It's a different kind of release event box, that's for sure. But I had these coming anyway, so... Even with those last two poles being something. Well, doubles. I mean, it sucks, but it happens. That's why you don't gamble. Alright. Dunghaven Hooter. This page can only be contracted face down this is using trap. When this page is flipped face up as a result of combat, reduce the attacking damage to zero and end combat. X beasties you control to cover LP equal to the current, to the current LP of the attacking beastie divided amongst them, however you choose in multiples of five. Dung and Hooter. This guy is pretty cool. He doesn't like a crocodile. The cry of excitement is a loud snort, which also means that lunch is nearby. Tall bunny. Okay, so it's uh, forest water. Umbaroo. Roperite. I do not believe I've seen this guy before. That's cool. They say many Roperites of different types of knots that create their no nooses. <laughs> Alright. Hoop Snake. Agro Pelter. I haven't seen this guy either. Hide Behind. Invisibility. Water gun. Poison arrow. Bookmark. Forest aura. Times seven. And water aura. Times five. As well as ground terror. For the packs. I want to pull anything foil, please. Shadow token. Dawn. Water aura. Dark lightning orb. 
water to wine. Frostbite. Trinity Amulet. Uh, Murphy Burrow, Mud Monster. Earth's Binding. Kalu Palak. Potion Cellar. And a Reverse Mountain Critter of Ball Mountain. Dynamite Token. Dust. Water Aura. Destroy Aura. Luffer Lane. He's a dude on the pack. Kinderhook Blob. Smoke Screen. Bloodlust. The Werewolf of Defiance. Vampire Mercy Brown. Born from the Air. The Reverse Veggie Man. Here's a guy on the pack. Zombie token. Daytime. Water aura. Dark lightning orb. Ludwig. Poltergeist. Halloween ghost sheet. Jack o' lantern bomb. Mask. Exquisite stew. Veggie mat. Bellwick. And a full hollow injured coal. Alright, we got a full hollow in here. That's all that matters in the end. Even if it is someone who probably got a full hollow. Anyway. On to the next deck. We have the Man Shack. Swamp Priestess. Alright, so Man Shack Swamp Priestess. Whenever a beastie enters the arena. From anywhere other than the caster's chapter, generate one beastie zombie token with 10 LP and 10 damage attack. All beastie zombies in the arena gain the following effects. If target beastie is destroyed by this page's attack, generate one beastie zombie token with 10 LP and 10 damage whose type is the same as destroyed page. And then their ability. This page is in the afterlife. Activate following effect X times where X is equal to the number of beastie tokens present in the arena. Deal 20 damage to target beastie artifact or caster. Pretty powerful card. The Swamp Ooze does wonders for my hair. It's lovely. Bunny man. Mm, bunny bunny. Bunny. Times four. Moon eyed people. Also times four. The shadow people. Times two. Matt Squatch. Necromancy. Times five. Proton beam. Crossroads. Transfiguration. Bookmark. Dark Aura. Times six. And Cosmic Aura times four. Two night times. And stars. And for the packs. Oh yeah, we never went there. I'll go through that last. Because why not? Packs are always the exciting part. Especially when it's the box you haven't found like that. Booster box opening for you. Winter, Light Aura, Aeron, Nightmare, Poltergeist, Halloween Ghost Sheet, Murfreesboro Mud Monster. I always like I, I always stumble on that. Coffee Cup, Dispel Eater, Light Elemental. Born from the earth? Did we miss the hollow there? Where was the hollow? Oh, oh, it was the light elemental. Whoops. Right. Nameless token. Farm. Light orange. Black eyed children. Lufferland. What is his description? 
For a horse, its bite is worse than its kick. I believe that. Static Lawn. Kindred of Lawn. Fane Death. Caster Center MD. Vampire Mercy Brown. Alaskan Vortex. That's one of the unlucky 13. It's common. Ooh, and a reverse headless horseman. Very happy to pull her. Leave a carved pumpkin outside your door on the night before Halloween. You might luck out and the headless horseman will take that instead of your head. And that's so sweet. And the last pack. Dynamite token. River. Lightning Aura. Air Rods. Cosmic Aura. Static Aura. Jack o' Lantern. Boost Aura. Crystallized Light. Zombie Apocalypse. Twin Meteor. And Reverse Hollow Frank Shaw's Gargoyle. First copy of this guy, too. I don't know. He's good. He's Earth. So he has a big cost. Most of them do. Having the misfortune to look eyes or to lock eyes with this beastie is known to fill even the bravest of caster with terror. As if your heart has turned to stone. The worlds are cool. And then we got two of these and two rule books. But who cares? So this is a uh, yeah. Release event medal. And that's that. Thanks a lot for watching. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like. And if you really enjoyed it, hit that subscribe button. And I'll catch you next time. Until then, bye bye.